Is it time to buy or sell Palantir stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Palantir. Our initial report was published on our website on Friday, August 11, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since August 9, 2023, our system has ranked Palantir as a sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 4.58. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. Surprisingly, the stock has performed better than our system predicted, with a gain of 1.05%. This translates to an average return of 0.35% per day since it was listed as sell candidate. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 43.5% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 43.5% and 93.73%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 77.8% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 12.93% and 133.92%. This translates to a price range of $17.40 to $36.05 after a year. Our latest daily update for Palantir includes the headline, Palantir stock price down 0% on Friday. No changes to the price of Palantir stock on the last trading day, Friday, August 11, 2023. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 4.49% from a day low at $14.91 to a day high of $15.58. The price has fallen in 6 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 13.48% for this period. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $20.24, and the lowest price was $5.84. Currently, the price is 23.86%, or $4.83, below the 52-week high, and 65.76%, or $29.59, below the all-time high on January 27, 2021, when the price reached $45. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Thursday, January 5, 2023, Jefferies set a price target of 7.5. On Thursday, January 5, 2023, Jefferies set a price target of 7.5. On Thursday, January 5, 2023, Jefferies set a price target of 7.5. On Wednesday, December 21, 2022, Wolf Research set a price target of 4.5. On Wednesday, December 21, 2022, Wolf Research set a price target of 4.5. Analysts have given Palantir stock a general buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Palantir. There are few to no technical positive signals at the moment. The Palantir stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $16.86 and $16.56. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, August 1, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 22.91%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Volume fell during the last trading day while price remained unchanged. This may be an early warning, but it may also not. We still recommend that you pay attention over the next couple of days. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal. Pivots, sell signal 9 days ago. Bollinger, 
by signal 75 days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 7 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 4 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages holds a sell signal. If we look at the 12-month chart we see short moving average, sell signal 5 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 68 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages by signal 128 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Palantir Palantir finds support from accumulated volume at $14.71 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock may move much during the day, volatility, and with a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.670 between high and low, or 4.49%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 7.47%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Palantir, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. A negative P-E ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even established companies experience down periods, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P-E ratios may signal insufficient profit and possible bankruptcy risks. In other news, the next earnings report for Q3 2023 is expected on NOV 06, 2023. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Palantir. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Palantir is at $16. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Palantir encounters its first support level at $14.71. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Palantir from multiple analyst sources is buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. The five most recent insider trades were executed by Sankar Sham, who bought and sold 9,300,212 shares or options in the company. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of minus 18.148. Overall, insiders purchased 11,146,235 shares and sold 16,258,485 shares in the last 100 trades. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set. Is Palantir stock a good buy? The Palantir stock holds several negative signals and despite the positive trend, we believe Palantir will perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. Therefore, we hold a negative evaluation of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Monday, August 14th, we expect Palantir to open down $0.110 and start trading at $15.30. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.